I started out doing commercials and modeling. I did like Burger King, Barbie, I did all kind of stuff like that. So that was fun. Commercials were a good way to start, I thought. Just being in front of the camera, being on set, being in that whole environment. Family support is huge. My parents are so supportive of me. My mom would fly out there with me to auditions and my dad's very supportive of me as well. So definitely support your kids. If this is their passion and you know this is what they want to do, you need to back them up 100%. And even if it's not what they want to do, find what they love and support them. I'm in LA most of the time when I'm working, but whenever I'm not working, I get to come back home in Houston and hang out with my family and my friends, and that's always nice. They keep me really grounded, but then whenever I get to go out to LA, I get to see some more of my friends, my acting friends, and I get to be on my show and live my dream. So I kind of get the best of both worlds. My first experience on set, I was probably like seven years old. I was a show called I'm With Her on ABC, and I was really young. I played a young version of Terry Polo, and so I had to look like her, and I was kind of nervous. I had no idea what was really going on, but I had a lot of fun. It was a good first experience. To prepare for an audition, I usually get the audition from my agent or my manager. They'll email it to me, and they'll send the breakdown of the character, which is all about the character. It kind of gives you a little insight into their world. So I read that. Sometimes they'll attach the whole script. So I really like reading the whole script so I know everything that's going on. And then I usually memorize my lines, and I will go get coached. I have like different acting coaches that I go to, so I'll go get coached, and then I usually like to get frozen yogurt before an audition. It kind of pumps me up. So I do that and then go to my audition and hopefully nail it. What do I do to prepare myself to be on set? I definitely memorize my lines because you don't want to go on set and not know your lines. That's kind of embarrassing and you have to redo it and everyone gets kind of impatient with you. So definitely know your lines. Be friendly to everyone. I know some people... They get kind of caught up in everything and they get to be they forget to be nice to everyone. So, be kind to everyone, everyone including the crew. They're working just as hard as you. Being on set of a commercial is way different than being on set from a movie or a TV show. On movies, things generally take a lot longer. Um, they have usually just one camera, so they have to do a shot and then they'll move the camera another little bit of an angle and then move it again and then move it again. And then on Ant Farm, um, we have multi-cameras. So we only have to do it a few times and we have it from every single angle. And a commercial is generally from just a couple angles, so it's not as challenging. I think movies are definitely the most challenging. The best thing about working on Ant Farm is being on the same lot as a bunch of other Disney shows. We work right next to Lab Rats and Jesse and Wizards of Waverly Place filmed there and Austin and Allie. So we get to see them like during our lunch breaks, we'll ride our bikes around on the lot and we see them and we're like, oh, hey guys, and hang out with them. And then upstairs in the production office, we have like a huge ball pit. So like we'll go up there sometimes, hang out, play around, be little kids. It's fun. <laughs>